Hey guys, Anthony here from Anthony School of Technology. Today we're going to go through a Samsung signage solution. This solution is called Magic Info Express 2. Cool things to know about Magic Info Express 2 is one, it will work with your Samsung system on chip displays and it is completely free. So to get started, you'll be asked to name your business as well as confirm its opening hours. Once that's out of the way, you'll be greeted with the welcome page. You may notice, for example, here we have quick start, custom design, and ad clip. Ad clip is something more based around dropping some pictures, videos, and having the algorithm create for you, well, an ad clip, about like 40, 60 seconds of video. Custom design is where we're going to focus today. So first of all, you will select whether your display is in portrait or landscape. That can be done as I've just shown here. And then you're also greeted with the list and all the template types you can follow. So for example, template one is just a blank canvas. And then you're going to start seeing some split pages and whatnot as you go down the list. Pro tip, if you go to the very end, you will actually be shown some pictures. Now you can use these pictures, but they are great for letting you get a feel of what the finished product can look like. For example, this menu, quite easy to tweak. All I have to do is select where it says enter text and then I just enter the text I want. So for example, with the restaurant menu, I'm going to go starters, mains, desserts, standard fare here. And then after that, if you go into your content, you can click whatever content you want, drag it into its box, and then it will automatically fill it appropriately. Again, guys, this is really simple. I'm just using Samsung standard imagery but this could be your own restaurant's photos, bar photos, whatnot. It's very easy to tweak. But anyway, let's leave this and I'm gonna show you now how to create a complete from scratch custom template. So again, I would recommend personally going with option one because option one gives you the most freedom in how you want your template to look. I'm gonna change the background by selecting backgrounds. You have a wide range of backgrounds up there, but if that's not enough for you, hitting the plus at the end will actually allow you to add your own background options. So this could be a company logo, bar logo, like um, anything really. Um, for this case, I'm going to go with the chalkboard background. I then click on text, simple as this, drag your text in, enter in what you want it to say, and it's as easy as that. You also have controls up at the top, so that will let you edit your text. For example, increasing the size of your text, adding a background to your text, changing the color of your text, alignment of your text. Again, we do not try and stray too far from softwares and systems that you're already used to using. So a lot of this will be familiar to you. Okay, let's get into widgets. Widgets in the Magic Info Express 2 are basically smart iconographies such as an analog or a digital clock, for example. This will actually use the internal displays clock. So even if you lose internet connection, there is no worries of your time getting lost. You can also add smarter features such as RSS feeds or media RSS feeds. And if you want to go a step further, you can add a web link to this also. My personal favorite is without a doubt the weather widget. Why I like it is because it's powered by AccuWeather and you can actually get the weather not just for your country, but for your city and even your village when applicable. This has an added benefit because in the fine tuning settings, which you'll see above, you will be able to actually choose a city image. This will help you get localized imagery showing up on your screen. Ideally, if you're like in a bar, dentist, doctors, cafe, whatever that may be, and you just wanna add that little bit of local touch. Sometimes you might prefer a cleaner look and that's fine as well. Make your weather widget completely opaque and then you're good to go. Nice and minimalistic. Here, we are going to do a very quick recap. It is worth actually showing you in a realistic manner how quick you can get content from your device to your display. It is also worth noting that Magic Info Express 2 is not limited to Windows. It works on iOS, Android and Mac. So no matter what your preference is in regards to your device, you should have easy access to Magic Info Express 2 for your Samsung signage displays. Now that you have your content all in order, you have your animation set up, you might want to give it a quick preview. 
quite easy. Hit the bottom right icon, mark preview, and away you go. This will let you view your content as it will look on the display. Now that you know you're 100% happy with your content after the preview, the next step is to actually get your content now onto the display. Again, this is super duper easy. All you have to do is ensure that your mobile device or your laptop is actually sitting on the same network as the displays. Once you have that ensured, all you have to do is hit the icon on the very top right hand side, which is marked send. Once you've hit send, it will prompt you to enter a schedule. The schedule works off a very simple drag and drop method. You will select the template on the left hand side and you will drag it over to the time slot that you want it to appear on. For example, if you're in a restaurant business, you will likely have a breakfast, lunch and dinner split. If you're working in retail, you might want to prepare an offer for the weekend in advance. This will let you do so and ensure that your offer will only show up on the screen on the time that you designate it to. Once you're happy with your schedule, hit the icon on the top right hand side and then it will scan the network for your displays. You will select your display and then you are done. I hope you found this session beneficial. If you have any further questions around Magic Info Express 2 or its bigger brother, Magic Info Premium, please leave me a comment below and I'll be happy to help. Thank you.